welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to play What on Earth Did I Order? I have this giant box from Victoria's Secrets and I thought I would unpack it with you. So let's get started. I have absolutely no idea what is in most of these boxes. I did bring some scissors to make it a little bit easier to open. <clears throat> First item we got is fresh and clean. Guys, if you haven't tried this mist, it smells so fresh, um, but not cottony. Um, see, I think this one is sweet apple, tangerine, and the sea spray. And this one is so good. I love the smell of this one. I believe they were out of the lotion when I bought this, but this is a great spray, especially to refresh during the summer. Next item. Very Santal, guys. This one is amazing. And if you have this Le Labo Santa, Santal 33, it goes great with this lotion and the spray. The berry in here makes it just a little bit more um, maybe citrusy. But man, it smells amazing when you mix the two of those together. Next item. It's in a bag. Maybe it'll be a little easier to open. We got the Cool and Bright Christmas Edition, the Cool and Bright Glow. Um, I actually have not smelled this one, and it does not have the notes on it, so I'm not really sure what it's supposed to smell like. Let's take a look. Hmm, that's kind of soft and creamy, but um, zesty at the same time. Oh, here it says luminous musk and candied pear. I would definitely say I can smell the pear and the musk in that one. And the next thing. And guys, I did get all of these on um, Victoria's Secret semi-annual sale. So I didn't go too crazy. The Merlot pear. Guys, this one is so good. Um, it smells like fruit punch um, with a little bit of musk. It's amazing. Next one. I'm going through these kind of fast because there's so many. Um, I don't want you guys to be here forever. Oh, another Merlot pear. Sometimes I like to, if I have the mist and I really like it, I like to get a couple of body lotions to go with it um, because I usually go through the body lotion a lot faster than the mist. Next one. Oh, the Pear Glacé. Guys, this one smells amazing. And it goes really well with the, um, oh, the Joe Malone Freesia and Pear. It goes so pretty with that lotion and spray. Um, definitely have to check that combo out. And we have, oh, this one is awesome. The Sparkling Creme. Um, this one is Glistening, Coconut, Soft Marshmallow, and Shine Bright. This one is a great winter fragrance. I love this one. I do have the mist and one body lotion of it already. So that's just to add to it as a backup. I think most of these are probably backup. Let's see, I can't get into this one. Next we have the Honey Oil. Guys, if you haven't tried the Honey Line for um, Victoria's Secrets Pink, it is one of my favorite. It is great to go underneath so many different lotions. Or different, sorry, not lotions, different perfumes. Um, it makes a great base scent for a million different things. Plus all your um, scents that have honey in them as well. Oh, the Blushing Bubbly. 
So guys, this one is not the same as the Champagne Toast. It is similar, but it's a little bit more musky. Um, and I really like both of them. Champagne Toast is one of my very favorites. But this is just enough different that I really enjoy this one. Um, and again, it's a backup for what I already have. Let's see, what do we got next? We have another oil. Guys, I use lots of body oil underneath my lotion. So this is the honey ginger oil. Um, I really like the honey ginger wash um, and the oil. I didn't like the lotion very much, so I used just the regular honey um, body lotion with it. And we've got a soft and clean gleam or glow, I guess. Um... And this one is bubbly champagne and juicy mandarin. I thought maybe I could wear this one because I don't think they had the body cream. Oh, that one's pretty. I thought this might pair well with either the blushing bubbly or the champagne toast. And... Got, ooh, I've been waiting for this one. Midnight Blush. I have not smelled this one. This is Moonflower, Creamy Woods, and Star Crust, Crust Lover. Um, so we, when I was fairly young and first married, we had this beautiful moonflower plant that bloomed in our backyard um, right outside our back door. And we did not live in a nice part of town. But that moonflower was so beautiful. I would sit outside on the porch at the back and at night just so I could see it bloom. And it smelled so pretty. So I was hoping this one would remind me of that. Having a little bit of a hard time smelling it. So oh, This one's good. This um, almost has a Baccarat Rouge kind of DNA to it. Let's see what else we got. We've got another blushing bubbly. Again, that's just a backup um, so that I have it so that I can finish up the mist because um, I like the mist to match my lotion for the most part. And let's see what else we got here. We've got another, oh no, this is the Cool and Bright Mist to go with the lotion. That candied pear in this is just really good. This is a good one, guys. I don't know if they still have some, but definitely pick that one up. Let's see what we got next. We got another sparkling cream, um, and again, that's a backup, so I can finish up my mist. Whoa, I'm about to knock this all on the floor. Just have a few more in here. This one is, oh, the spray that goes with the Midnight Bloom. Super excited to have this one. Definitely doesn't smell like Moonflower. Um, I'm kind of bummed about that. Moonflower has more of like um, maybe a citrusy scent to it. Um, but this one is definitely pretty and definitely would go with the Baccarat or the Cloud or the numerous other dupes to that perfume. This is the Ruby Rose Raspberry. I'm so excited to have this one back. Um, guys, so funny story. 
I thought that I was allergic to this one, and so I returned it. Oh, this smells so good with a little bit of raspberry and a whole lot of rose. This is beautiful. Um, I returned it because I thought I was allergic to it and found out a little bit later that I just had the flu. I wasn't allergic to that. All right. See what we got here. And we got another one of the Cool and Bright um, lotions, which I'm excited to have with that candy pair. That'll be nice. We got two more in here. Got another one of the Ruby Rose. And then hopefully the spray is in here. Hopefully that's this last one. Oh, yes. And we've got the spray to the Ruby Rose. This one is so great. I love the smell of rose. Mature rose, sweet rose any kind of rose it doesn't matter but the berries in this one just really make it a unique scent i love the berries with the rose that is a really cool scent so the last thing that i got is the blanket so i don't know how many of you guys have seen this or gotten yours already Get the trash out of this So this is pink on this side, so super fun blanket that came with all that. So I hope you guys enjoyed that. Um, I'll see you next time for my next video. All right, thanks for joining me for my haul from Victoria's Secrets.